Good day, everybody. This is Dr. Nandi. I come here every day to teach you or to express to you new problems in algebra and statistics. My goal is to help you succeed in solving math problems. This is my only goal. So I come back every week with new problems. So the only way I can keep doing this is if you please hit the red button at the bottom right corner of the screen. Please subscribe to my channel. And I'll appreciate that if you'll please hit the subscribe button at the bottom right corner of the screen, okay? So let's get started. Okay, so today we are going to work on a problem on logarithm, logarithmic expression. We have a complicated expression and we want to write it as a logarithm of a single expression applying the rules of logarithm. So the problem is, the first term is two multiplied by logarithm of four base six. Next one, plus one third multiplied by logarithm of r minus six base six. And then the next term is minus half logarithm of r base six. So we are going to use the properties of logarithm. Notice all the bases of the logarithms are same, they're base six, okay? The first term, we are going to work on the first term when it is two multiplied by logarithm four base six, that two can be transferred as an exponent of four. So it becomes logarithm of four exponent two base six. The multiplication two factor becomes an exponent of four. This is a property of logarithm. The next term, the coefficient one third becomes the exponent of r minus six. Again, application of rules of logarithm. Minus the coefficient half in the third term becomes the exponent of r, okay? So now let's simplify this. So the first term, four squared, four multiplied by four is 16. So it's logarithm of 16 to the base six. And the next term, we have a minus sign involved, same base six. So it, by application of the rules of logarithm, this is a division rule, okay? So it becomes logarithm base six, and we have r minus six exponent one third, and minus that thing becomes divided by r to the power of half or r exponent half. <coughs> now we will find, Again, apply another rule of logarithm, the plus sign between the two terms becomes multiplication. So it becomes logarithm to the base 16, base, sorry, logarithm to the base six, and 16 is multiplied by r minus six exponent one third divided by r exponent half, which can be further simplified to logarithm to the base six, 16 multiplied by one third is cube root of r minus six and half is square root of r. So the final expression is logarithm to the base six, 16 multiplied by cube root of r minus six divided by square root of r. This is the most simplified version of the complicated expression that we had in the beginning of the problem. I'll stop here today. If you have any question, please write me a comment. I'll reply to your individual comment, okay? Please come back every week. I solve new problems in math, in statistics, and in algebra. And please do not hesitate to write me a comment and please subscribe to my channel by hitting the subscribe button at the bottom right corner. 
that is the only way i can come back every week with new problem my only goal is to help you achieve success in solving math problems so take care thanks for watching have a nice day and see you next time and please subscribe to my channel